Hey guys, I hope you're fine and doing well today. In this video, I will discuss one biotech stock that according to my analysis can jump to 3x levels on June 1. Yes, you heard it right. On 1st June, I am predicting it to jump max by 3x levels. You must have started thinking that increasing your money to 3x is this simple. Buy the stock now and sell when it jumps to 3x levels and retire early. But hold on, do not get too excited there. There is one risk factor involved that can ruin this event. Sorry to spoil the mood, but life is not that simple. Investments carry risk, and no investment is without risk taking. Also, don't lose hope, stay optimistic. There are solutions for that risk as well. Well, enough of that crap. Let's start discussing the stock. But just one small thing. Kindly know that knowing the name of the stock from this video and then buying the stock right away is not investing. It is called gambling. You must fully understand the risk and reward scenario before making any investment decision. So watch completely and listen to the game plan and do not miss the part where I discuss the risk and reward scenario. If you are interested to receive early alerts on potential multi-bagger stocks with full buying selling guidance, then consider joining on Discord through Patreon. Our Discord members get an early alert on stocks like Sava near 10 before it jumped to 120 plus and on Anoes they got an early alert near 25 before it jumped to 97. I am not saying that every pick is 3x or 10x guaranteed stock, but comparing the downside of some of the stock picks with the upside of my unique picks is huge. The link to join on Discord through Patreon is given in the description down below. The company I am talking about today is Synexus, Nasdaq ticker symbol SCYX. According to the top experts of Wall Street, the average 12 month price target is $27.33, which indicates a possible increase of 3x. The high price target is around $40 while being pessimistic, the stock can go to a low price of around $20. The market has a very bullish perspective of this stock. 46.16% of total shares are held by 35 institutions. Now you must be wondering why a majority of analysts are so bullish on this stock. Well, according to my research and understanding, this biotech company has developed a first of its kind antifungal product with better results and efficacy levels versus existing treatments. The FDA has granted their lead drug with fast track status and priority review. The FDA decision date is set for June 1 this year for its lead drug. There is only one approved drug in the competing market. Analysts are very optimistic and chances of FDA approval are high because of better clinical data versus the existing treatments and due to the need of the treatment. Sales potential is huge. Even Chinese companies are interested in their drug and have signed an agreement to market their drug in China and will pay $10 million upfront in double digit royalties per sale. There are several near term catalysts that make it a compelling investment case. But the risk of getting their FDA decision delayed is also very real. FDA can simply set a new date for the decision announcement, citing the pandemic restrictions. Also, there is a risk of FDA rejecting their NDA application, but chances of rejection are low given the positive data and prevailing treatments. There is one very strong point in favor of Synexis getting the approval and successfully marketing their product, and that is its drug can be prescribed to women during pregnancy. And why is that an edge over other treatments? It's an edge because existing drugs are not recommended for pregnant women. Under ideal conditions, I expect Synexus to jump by 3x levels, but given the current market scenario where investor interest is not that high, I would recommend profit taking on strength. Even 2x return is ideal in current market situations. Also, keep in mind that we bought this stock at 8 and had plenty of time to average down when it dipped to $6. So this 3x return depends on what level you bought the stock on. I highly recommend that you listen to my investment rationale and make your decision accordingly. Making totally depends on understanding the company and its potential. Listen to what I have to say and decide for yourself whether it will jump by 2x to 3x or not. Synexus is a biotech company that delivers therapies for the treatment of fungal infections in the US. Its lead candidate, Ibrexa Fungerp, is phase 3 successful drug pending FDA approval. FDA action date is set for June 1. If approved, chances of which are quite high due to better clinical stage data, it will only be the second available treatment for vulvovaginal candidiasis VCC. Ibrexa Fungerp is a novel oral and intravenous drug for the treatment of various fungal infections including vulvovaginal candidiasis VCC and refractive invasive fungal infections. The high prevalence of VVC coupled with the presence of a single product makes it an attractive opportunity for Synexis. Further, there is no FDA approved therapy for recurrent VVC in the US. Again, there is only one approved product in the US for VCC and no approved drug for recurrent VVC. 
VVC is highly prevailing and increasing every year, with around 9.5 million patients received more than 18 million prescriptions for VVC. Many of these patients are prescribed and retreated two, three, and even more than four times in a year. The peak sales have been estimated to hit 400 to 600 million dollars in the US by 2027. The company has directed its attention to one of the most recurring fungal infections. The number of women affected with vulvovaginal candidiasis is more than 125 million all around the world. As per the press release of Synexis, around 70-75% of women worldwide experience this issue at least once in their lifetime, while 40-50% to will experience it multiple times. And the only approved product to deal with this is fluconazole. In the US alone, more than 14 million prescriptions of fluconazole are given per annum, in addition to approximately 18 million over-the-counter sales of the same drug, with sales forecasted at around $1.2 billion. Moreover, fluconazole is reported to provide a cure of around 55%, and it also warns of certain side effects, such as fetal harm. However, it has been observed that some women are resistant to fluconazole. It is also reported that fluconazole causes some renal, heptic, and central nervous system issues, while the product offered by Cynexis is free from such issues. It has not reported any renal or liver failures in more than 600 patients. Ibrexafungib is also a favorable candidate for use with other azole drugs to cure invasive aspergillosis. The reason why Ibrexafungib is potentially more suitable for hospital settings is that it kills the candida pathogens, whereas fluconazole only restrains their growth. In the wake of this scenario, Synexis has an enticing opportunity to capture the market. The drug is currently under review by the FDA, whose results are expected by June 1. Based on previous clinical trials, the company is very optimistic that the drug will be approved and they will be able to produce and market the product commercially. Once the drug hits the commercial avenue, given the huge number of patients of VVC in the US and taking very pessimistic estimates, it is expected that the company will be able to close sales of around $420 to $570 million in the US alone.